Well, I haven't done too much with the interior of my busted up pickup truck. I have replaced a crusty dashboard with uh, something slightly less crusty. You know, I took off the, the ugliness of the top of the seat cover. The bottom one is still here because that side's got a big hole in it. Um, I still have a hole in this dashboard and there is a crack right here. Overall, that looks pretty good. I did reset the aftermarket radio to make it actually kind of stay in place just a little bit better than it did before. Um, I never found out why this man drilled holes. I've really done next to nothing on the interior here. But I have a carpet. I have a slightly newer one. That's an automatic. So uh, I guess I'm gonna see if it fits. That'll be fun. Let's take the seat out. Now I've got a sneaking suspicion that this is nearly four half inch bolts. Oh yeah. Unfortunately, I don't have standard. I'm a metric boy. So we got uh, uh, less than ideal, but I'll I'll ignore that. It's just, uh, oh, fuck it, let's start cranking on it, who cares? Fuck, okay. It's always interesting to, to learn things about previous owners while doing work on a vehicle. <laughs> For instance, this guy owned a dog, but not a vacuum. Yeah, that's a lot of rust. 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 It's less than ideal. So I ended up just cutting the uh, cutting the threads off to get this off. I'll be able to see this thing. Uncovered for the first time. They're doing yard work. They're doing yard work. Oh my god.
So I don't know what I was expecting, but I don't think I expected it to be as bad as this. Um, that side looks great. That side looks good. I think I am going to keep the cover off, though. Just uh, just let it happen, how it happens. Oh, there goes a tree. Nice. All right, now we get to see what kind of owner had this thing beforehand. Um, Holy shit, wait, 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 wait. There's still clear coat on it. Wait, wait, wait. You can still see the paint. What's that? What's that? A fucking mixtape? Oh shit. And then you got a. Uh, letters. It's mine. Oh yeah, it's a bit of a mess. All right, well, I don't have much going on here, but uh, being able to see the holes in the floor that I didn't know were there are pretty good. Uh, both in the same spot. Makes sense, that's just what happens. And, you know, the cab corners are gone. Yeah. Pretty much see right through everything anyway, so uh, I kind of expected it. Rust is over, going on there, brush on. Letting it kind of harden, not harden, letting it dissolve the rust. It seems to be doing its job. Gonna wipe all that off. Um, not gonna do too much else because the carpet's gonna come back out once uh, once it once it goes in. And I'm gonna run. Uh, I'm gonna lay like dynamat as much as I can, but that's not gonna happen today. So I didn't actually manage to cut this how uh, I should have. So now I have to have a little bit of fun here. Get all that up underneath the shifter boot here. Be golden. So it doesn't look too bad. That's cut a little wide. And I'm not, I'm not too worried about this. I, I paid 30 bucks for this carpet, so it's not like it's a big expenditure. You know, had I bought an actual fitted carpet, I would be slightly more careful. Works, but honestly, this, uh, this looks pretty good. split right here in the carpet to uh, let the seatbelt come through, but it's... It 
doesn't have a split on this side to let the seatbelt come through. So, a little confused. Hide that one. So a fairly interesting color choice here. Really, I chose this because this is the only Ford that uh, that was out in the yard with with carpet and not the same vinyl flooring. But uh, man, I really wish I, I'd made that one a little nicer. So there's gonna be a hole there for for like ever now. Um, everything else, if I can get it to stay down, because it's it's nearly it's nearly perfect. So it, it was between a like a 89 from an 85. Very similar, obviously, most of this stuff lined up perfectly, but, uh, yeah, it's not too bad. Oof, ow. You know, I gotta say, I'm pretty happy with this. It's really coming together. And it's always fun to, 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 to notice something. Un, uh, unintended while you're doing this. So this is the uh, this is the detent spring. It holds the door open. Now, I've had issues. My door falling in. I thought, ah, oh, it'll just be the bushing. That's not a big deal. I just realized that there is no detent spring. It is broken off.